Hi, I'm Bob Ostrom. I'm a children's book illustrator. Thanks for joining me for this free art lesson. Today we're going to draw an alien. All right, here we go. So let's start out with his eyes. I think this alien's going to have three eyes. Okay. I like to start out with the eyes because that's where most of the expression comes from. We're going to make this guy a little kooky here. Okay. Give him a nice big smile. And let's make his head just like this. Good. Okay. We're going to put him in a spacesuit. So it's got to have kind of a little collar to it. Just like that. Make that look like it's bolted to a spacesuit. Let's give him a helmet. Great. And here's his body. He's kind of a short, stout little guy. Comes around like this. Since he's an alien, we're going to give him a pair of alien boots. <laughs> there we go. Good. Some treads on those guys there. That's looking good. Let's put another one over here. Perfect. Bring that around there. Put some treads on that guy. Let's make them look like high tops. That'd be kind of fun. Okay. I think we're going to give this guy, maybe we'll give him four legs. How's that sound? Pretty fun. Okay. There's his other one right there. That's kind of facing forward. There's the treads. And here's one more. So he's got four legs down there. All right. And this one's facing forward too. There's the front of it. Bring that around. Put some treads on there. Okay, he's looking pretty good so far. What do you say we give him a little zipper there for a spacesuit and a utility belt? Because all aliens have utility belts. There we go. Can't forget the buckle. Let's put a couple little things on here. He's just carrying some stuff. Okay. Give him some arms. A little elbow joint there. And he's got some space gloves on. Let's give him a whole bunch of little fingers there. The guy has three fingers. And let's make it look like those are space gloves. Okay. And then this hand, let's give him a, let's give him a laser. How's that sound? Okay, so we'll put his hand up like that. Don't forget he's wearing space gloves there. Good. There's his thumb and his finger. And he's kind of pointing his gun up in the air there. So we'll put that there. Just like that. Don't forget that we got a little aimer on the back there. That's good. Looking good so far. I think we need to dress this guy up a little bit. He's looking a little plain. So let's give him a bigger smile. That's pretty cool. And maybe we can make him we'll make him have a little bit of Stuff here. It can make him kind of fish like. How's that sound? Let's make him make his helmet full of water. Got some bubbles there. And we'll give him a little bit of skin texture. That looks pretty good. OK. 
okay, he's kind of a happy guy. And it might be kind of fun if we put him on a planet surface here. So let's draw a few craters around him. There's one right there. Good. And let's put a couple in front of him here. That goes like that. Draw the inside of the crater there. The outside like that. And we'll put a little, little landscape behind him like that. And another one over here like this. And maybe we'll just pretend that he just landed here and planted his flag. Okay, and there's his little alien flag back there. Cool. That's looking pretty good. Now, what do you say we add a little bit of depth to the sky by adding some cross hatching and a little bit of line work in here. So we'll make that belt look like it's a little darker. Just kind of color that in. Just like that. That looks good. We're going to add a little bit of line weight all the way around this guy just to make him look a little more solid. That's good. This kind of helps with our shading a little bit. So we add a little bit heavier line when we go underneath things just to make them look like they have shadow. I think this guy looks like he needs a space badge to match his flag back there. So let's put that right there. And we know that he is from a planet that looks like this. There you go. That's looking pretty good. And let's get some more line weight underneath here. Make him look like he's actually standing on the moon there, or on a planet. A little bit of shadow under there. That's looking good. Okay. Well, he sure does have a lot of treads on his shoes, huh? That looks pretty good. And let's add a little bit of line weight underneath here. Good. You guys still with me? Okay. We'll add a little bit more fun to his shoes here. That's looking pretty good. We'll color this guy in. And this one over here too. Okay. Let's add a little reflection to his helmet. I think we're pretty close to being finished with that guy. Let's just add a little bit more shadow underneath him. Okay. And there you have it. There's our space alien. Hope you guys had fun drawing that. This has been Bob Ostrom. If you'd like to see more of my work, you can visit my website at bobostromstudio.com. Be sure and check out all the rest of the videos that we have. Thanks. See you next time.